What's going on guys? Money Webby here. Hope you guys had a good Easter Sunday and you're ready to get back to winning some money on MLB DFS. So leave a like down below if you're excited. We have a nice nine game slate tonight. Some good pitching options at the top of the board. So definitely go and pound that like button. Let's try to see if we can get up to 30 likes on this video. I really appreciate it, guys. And subscribe to the channel if you haven't already as well to join the Money Mob, the best place for your DFS needs, questions, tips, you name it, we got it. So let's get into my my two aces of the day and my triple play, my favorite three bats. So let's get into it, guys. My first ace of the day is going to be Danny Salazar for 10300 against Minnesota. I love this option just because he strikes out so many batters. Throughout his career, he has struck out 27% of the batters he has faced. That is an insane mark, so I definitely love that, especially for DraftKings scoring. You need the strikeouts. He already has 20 strikeouts throughout the year so if he limits the runs and the amount of hits he gives up and he gets a lot of strikeouts he doesn't even necessarily need the win to get you points he had 27 drafting points and he got the loss last game just because he had those 11 strikeouts I love him for that main reason I think the Indians will probably win this game as well so that definitely adds another four points definitely in the realm of possibilities he hasn't gotten the win on the year yet I think he can get it done here against a Minnesota lineup that isn't that spectacular they're decent but Danny Salazar can definitely strike out some guys like he has done throughout his whole career so you gotta lock him in my second ace of the day is gonna be John Lackey for 10,000 200 against the Brewers so we're looking at both the top option on the slate I think these guys are by far the safest both of them have a great shot of getting the win the Cubs against the Brewers should be an easy win for Lackey and he's actually been striking out a lot more guys this year through two games he already has 17 strikeouts and he is a much better pitcher at home through the last couple years that has been seen when he's been on the Cubs he has had much better games there he had 27 drafting points last game at home against a good Dodgers lineup so against a Brewers lineup that is definitely worse than the Dodgers lineup I think John Lackey can definitely get it done and get you 20 plus drafting points I don't see any way the Cubs lose this game so I definitely love Lackey in the spot you gotta lock him in my first play in my triple play is going to be Austin Ramone for 2,800 against the White Sox. This guy has filled in very well for Gary Sanchez. He has shown the power against the left-handed pitchers as well. He's going against one tonight against Holland, and I love the ballpark for this. They're playing in Yankee Stadium. The wind is blowing out to the outfield, so I think Austin Ramone is in a great spot. He's off to a tremendous year, batting 386, one home run, and four RBIs. Definitely getting it done. I think he can get it done against Derek Holland tonight as well, around 10 plus tracking points I think is definitely in the possibility and the price is definitely there at 2800 the ballpark couldn't be any better for Ramone as well so you gotta lock him in sticking in the same game we're gonna go with Chris Carter for 4300 against the White Sox same game the conditions and the ballpark is so good for hitters so I definitely love Chris Carter as well this guy is a home run beast he's off to a pretty bad start on the year but I think he can definitely turn things around he has shown tremendous power against left-handed pitchers he's going against one in this game I think he can definitely go deep he had like 40 plus home runs last year he hasn't gotten one this year yet so I think he's gonna be licking his chops ready to go against the left-handed pitcher trying to go deep in this game so you need to have some exposure to Chris Carter because I think he can definitely hit a home run in this game so you gotta lock him in. My third and final bat is gonna be Marcel Azuna for 3,500 against Seattle. He's going against a left-handed pitcher. The splits against the lefties are definitely there. The ISO, the Woba, all the stats you can look at are up for Marcel against the lefties. And he's off to a crazy good year, batting 404. 
five home runs and 18 RBIs. He is going insane. At 3,500, the price is definitely too low considering the amount of power he has against these lefties and just in general. This guy is built like an animal. He is massive and he's ready to hit a home run at every single game. He's had some monster games, 13 and 14, the last two. 27 just a few games ago 38 23 so the upside is definitely there at 3500 that is a great price with that kind of upside so you gotta lock them in so that's gonna do it guys go and leave a like down below if you guys enjoyed the video let's try to get this to 30 plus likes if you guys can do that for me i'd really appreciate it i love you guys so i would definitely even love you more if that is possible. Go and represent the money mob. Go and pound that like button and subscribe to the channel if you guys haven't already as well to come and join the money mob to get the daily fantasy videos every single day just to get your mind thinking DFS 24-7. So definitely go and do that as well. And you guys can come and follow me on Twitter to get my full lineups every single day for MLB, NBA. And if you guys want four full lineups, it's only $5 per day. So you can definitely try me out. Or if you want $20 for the full week, that's less than $3 per day. Daily Fantasy is a game of winning. You're trying to win every single day. But in the long term, that is where you're trying to get your success. It's hard to win every single day, guys. So definitely keep that in mind. It's a game of up and downs, but you want more ups than downs and that is the point of these videos to try to get you guys to be thinking dfs and get these like models and ideas for you guys to win consistently you can't be winning every single day you can't have that mindset you can't go out and try to win every single day the idea is get long-term success and to win more than you lose that is the name of the game so definitely go and follow me on twitter if you guys want the lineups you can just dm me or just follow me for the lineup i tweet out every single day that is for free and if you guys want to go and join the Money Mob on Facebook as well to get into the Facebook group to be talking some DFS with some other smart DFS players as well. We're up to 407 members. Just click on the link in the description below. It'll take you right to the group. I'll accept you in and we can talk some DFS. I love to do this for you guys. So remember to like the video down below if you haven't already. Subscribe if you haven't either. So good luck Money Mob. I love you guys. Let's go and win some money. Let's get it.